Hey there again, folks. Welcome back to my random gaming series. They're playing Half Swap. I have no clue what Half Swap means, but it sounds cool. I would like to thank folks over at What Pumpkin Games for letting me try this game out for free. It looks really cool. I will warn you up front, I'm probably not going to play this very long. You can probably tell by the length of the video. Of course, I could be lying and it make it like two hours long. I doubt it, but I'm not planning on playing very far into it. This looks like a, a very good game for me to stream, and I've been streaming a lot of story-based uh, point-and-click adventure games here lately. Over on my Twitch channel at uh, twitch.tv slash Uh Same name as uh, my YouTube. So, uh, yeah, this looks like it would be really good to stream. So I don't want to play too too far into it. I want to keep the, I want. I just want to get a taste so I, can, so I can get a good urge later to come back and play it. Yeah, let's go and hit new. New game! Let's do this. I'm guessing he's in the UFOs, since it's on his shirt. Oh, it's dog. <laughs> That's unexpected. More dog. I would do the same. <laughs> Your name is... So you're going to need a minute. <laughs> okay, you gave yourself a minute. Freak out. Freaking out. I'm freaking out. Oh my gosh. Big, long, mini-legged thing is after me. Um, he probably... If, if I'm lucky, you know, he, he's, he hadn't spent a lot of money at the gym because he hasn't spent all his money on socks. Well, you know, he was, he was, he didn't have any socks on. Never mind, he probably spends all his time at the gym. That was a dumb joke, I apologize. <laughs> because of the monster, the thing with all the legs and teeth. The one you barely got away from. Minutes up, though. You take a deep breath. Let uncertainness slip away into a toothy arm raggling darkness. And focus on what you know. Your name is Joy Claire. You live just outside the town of Haunt Switch. You are, in no particular order, a puzzle solver, a semi-orphan. Semi, semi That's confusing. Black. One of her parents is dead? Or both of them are dead? Or... Or she's adopted now? Confused. A dancer of multiple schools, an aspiring veterinarian, and a big sister. Speaking of, that monster, the one that barely missed eating you alive, only you're not thinking about that right now. It might be headed back outside where your little brother is. You've got to warn him. Okay. What is this? Is this look? <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Sorry. I felt the sneeze sneaking upon me. Just like a... Okay, yeah, monster. That's long. Nah, it's not, okay, good. It's not behind me. That's fix, that's fix safe. Nobody wants to be eaten by a monster as they're sneezing. That's just like, that's just like double crap. It's like, oh my gosh, my abdomen is being torn apart. I chew. That sucks because it's extra annoyance. I guess it could be useful if you know you like. I chew. You throw your, which forces your head to go forward and you headbutt the monster, you know, give him a little parting gift, you know. I guess that'd be the, the only good time, uh, good thing about a, a potential sneeze. That took a dark turn, I apologize. You guys are now going to be paranoid every time you get a cold when you're going to get eaten by a monster. Oh crap, I'm coming down with something. 
It's gonna eat my entrails. Mom won this award at around the same age as you for being best at ballet. It's pretty. Yeah, we can focus on the game. Okay, so that apparently is look, I'm guessing. Your babysitter gave you this for your birthday. Joey, she said. This wizard's the best. He lives in his little wizardly orb, just swimming in spells and glitter. He will protect you. Look, he's doing it right now. Your babysitter loves wizards, obviously. She's pretty great. Will it help us right now? Because we could use the help right now. Okay, so I can move around. Okay, good. Ooh, we got... Let's turn the lights on. Turn them off. And on again, okay. Just thought I would do that. Okay, we've got a bar here. Is this going to wind up being our inventory bar, or what? Now, is there any way to... Okay. Okay, good, good, good. It's the same thing as looking. Okay, I, w I was thinking that, that was kind of annoying if I had to, like... If I could just click through for one thing. But I had to go here to look at everything. Okay, good. Oh, okay, good. Yes, yes, yes. It's easy to make your very own cake. Or something like that. You're really excited to get this for your birthday last year, but you ran out of the baking stuff pretty quick. You could use regular sugar and flour or whatever, but it's not like you have those things just sitting around. Who does, honestly? People that people with moms, you guess. Yeah, yeah, I suppose so. What happens if we bake? Let's bake. Shake and bake. You're out a lot of baking stuff. You're, you're not too busted up about it, though. You're pretty tough. I am tough enough to be able to deal with the loss of the baking stuff. Along with ballet, you also study tap dancing. You haven't decided what you prefer. Ballet is fun, but tap's also fun in a different kind of way. You have considered blending the two, wearing one tap shoe and one ballet shoe at the same time, but decided to fully master both and earn the respect of your teacher before unveiling your boundary-shattering BLAP style to the world. I guess that's how it would work. Let's equip that. You add the tap dance abilitech to your technique. Yep, those are the words that refer to those concepts. You learned them literally just now. These will help if there's anything you need to shake up or shake off, or if you're just in the mood to shake it. <laughs> you do a few steps from twirling Merlin and thus th your thus far unfinished showcase of wizard themed dancing. This one's the Pyromancer's Hot Step. <clears throat> okay. What happens if I click on that? How about hot stepping? Well, lukewarm stepping. They don't give ballet trophies for tap dancing, but if they did, you might just win one of these yourself someday. Or maybe you win one for your ballet. You decide to dream big. Good plan to dream big. Win all of the dancing things. Do, do figure, sta uh, figure skating as well. You get more pressing concerns right now than the book report you have to hand in on Monday. Besides, none of these books are appropriate choices for a book report. According to your teachers, your teachers seem oddly fixated on award-winning books where beloved dogs are introduced and then inevitably die. You kind of hate your teachers sometimes. Yeah, those books. It's the 11th of November. Today started off just like any other day. With another sunrise and the sound of songbirds going hog wild out there in the trees, their songs have all gone, all but stopped. And now there's something else going hog wild out there. You don't know what it is, but it ain't birds, and it sure as heck ain't hogs. <laughs> I would agree with that. Can I mark it? You've already marked today's date as part of your daily routine. If anyone claims that you didn't exist on the date of November 10th, 1994, 
We can shove that big red X right in their face and prove them wrong. Good job getting the date. Through to the player game. <laughs> Ooh, pictures. These posters, they resonate so powerfully with the very core of your being. The animals, the magic, the power. They whisper to you in your dreams. Secrets of a better world on the other side of the stars. Okay, there's stuff up here. They should be pretty safe on the shelf, which is the point of shelves, you suppose. Puppy Surprise is having puppies. How many? That's a surprise. Puppy Surprise! Puppy Surprise! That's a real toy, I, I'm very sure. Um, I believe we used to carry those at Toys R Us when I worked there. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure that's the name of it. There's also a puppy in my pocket. Uh, Polly Pocket. Uh, something about a waterfall, I think. I don't know. Or whenever you look at the, this thing, the song from that commercial runs through your head like a snake monster on an autumn afternoon. It's a great place to stash your keepsakes, where they stay as safe as a team hiding in their bedroom from a snake monster. So we can search this. What you got? What you got? Reach inside the expected plush canine and... Puppy, su puppy surprise is having puppies. This is mildly gruesome. <laughs> ah yes, no one would ever think to look for your precious diary key inside a plush mother dog. Least of all your brother, who was upset he didn't get one of the, the puppies. You can be pretty melodramatic. Speaking of precious keys, there's also a beautiful old trinket that used to belong to your mom. You have no idea what it is, but looking at it reminds you of her. Honestly, you're not sure you'd be comfortable leaving it here with everything that's going on. Let's take the key. Oh, while you're at it, you think maybe you should keep this beautiful heirloom of your mom's close. Just a feeling, a deep, inexplicable, impossible to ignore feeling. That's a that's an adventure game. Okay, so that is our inventory. Good, good. I figured it was with the arrows there. You know what? Let's tap this puppy surprise. Show your loving puppy surprise your razzle dazzle. She doesn't say anything, but you can tell she's pretty floored. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so floored. Whoosh. Puppies! <laughs> you you dance the puppies out of my womb. They're very they're a very appreciative audience as always. Surprisingly, no one fell off the shelf this time. I like this. I like how it's how you can. It's not important, but it adds character. Being able to do this, do stuff like this. You definitely don't have to do it. We've got a couple books on the subject, but tap dancing, the preferred hot stepping of the unpretentious working class, has largely been snubbed by the literary elite. So yeah, I like I like how you can look at stuff and try different things. It may not be important, but it'll do a thing, you know. That's cool, I like that. You try to remember if Clarissa ever got any jams like this. You have so much in common. Annoying little brother, computer in your room, uh take a story bedroom. Um, as much as you hate to admit, Clarissa's life deviates from yours on a number of vertices. Her parents were around. She had a cool friend who was a boy, but not her boyfriend. No monsters in the yard, etc. I think I watched some Clarissa explains it all. I don't remember much about it. This is a raised and cushioned platform where you spend several hours every day unconscious and hallucinating. Usually while the majority of the other people are on the continent are also doing the same thing. I like I like doing that when people aren't doing it. That sounded dirty. I like sleep I tend to sleep when pe other people aren't. <laughs> I don't I don't sleep good at night. Your babysitter got you got you this junior veterinarian's med, med kit. It's kind of important to you, so you think you'll leave it here for now. It would really Bust you up if something happened to it. Let's show our appreciated by dancing. Guess one day you'll have to choose which dream to follow. Do you want to be a veterinarian who also dances a lot, or a world-class dancer who volunteers in the animal clinic in her spare time? Can't have it both ways. 
That would be quite the schedule. Ah, <sighs> you had a whole choreographed routine for the Colores theme song. Two, in fact. One tap, one ballet. But ever since the so show ended last month, it just makes you sad. Oh, well, Alex Mack is pretty cool, too, you guess. It looks like you might miss tomorrow's episode, though. But whatever. The preview said it was going to be a big, dumb dance plot. You hate those. <laughs> was, Sabrina to was Sabrina the Teenage Witch around at that point? I can't remember. I don't think I watched that one very much at all. Was Clarissa the... Was Clarissa explains it all? The one with Joey Lawrence that goes, Whoa! Or was that another one? I feel like that might be another one. There was another one. What's the name of it? I can't remember the... Crown. What was the other one? Pull the other one. I can't remember it. You're walkie-talkie. Half of a set. Your brother has the other one. Could come in handy. It looks like it could be, uh... Uh-oh. Hmm. Feels a little light. Uh-oh. Yep, no batteries. Remember cannibalizing the walkie-talkie when something else needed them. But you can't recall exactly... You can't recall exactly what the something else was. Hopefully not the other walkie-talkie, because that would suck. Those, were those bats? Those are bats. Oh my word. She has a big room. Uh oh. Is that Morse code? Is he Morse is he Morse coding us? Anyway guys, I'm gonna call it here. This is I like this game. I will be streaming this at some point. I hope you guys liked it as well. It, it'll... I'm playing mostly scary games in uh, or horror themed games in October, so it may be November when I get to this, but it will be early in November when I get to it. So yeah, this is this is a this, I like this game. Hopefully, you guys have enjoyed it enjoyed it as well. Um, the link will be down below if you want to get the game for yourself. I can't remember how much it was. I should I should have checked right before I started recording. I don't think it's just a lot. Um, and it's going to be in four acts. I'm assuming that each act will be its own its own uh, chapter. I mean, I'm assuming each act will be in the same game, meaning it'll update as it happens. I don't think you'll have to buy the act separate. That's what I'm trying to say. It's episodic. But I don't think you have to pay for each episode. I don't think. I could be wrong. I could be wrong on that. Don't take my word on it. But I just have the feeling it's not. Uh, because it's, well, for one thing, I didn't, I don't remember seeing anything about buy all, you know, pay this f to get them all, you know, which is what most of them do, you know. Like the Telltale Games, they'll be like, hey, episode one is out of Walking Dead. Pay this much for all five episodes, you know, when they happen. So I'm, I'm assuming it's going to be free updates. Uh, those are bats. But anyway, yeah, this is, a, this is a nice game. I'm liking it. And I will be getting back to it at some point. I'll, I'll start over. I'm not even going to say it. I'm going to start over completely on it when I, when I stream it. So anyway, guys, I do sincerely hope you all enjoyed. And I'll see you next time. Random game. Farewell.